Alrighty, hello guys, welcome your faces back to another Stormworks video. Today we are going to be messing around with this car ferry right here. Uh, now if you look at this thing, I have tried to dock it. Um, it just, we just had a few issues where, uh, where I crashed straight into the ramp. Anyway, uh, we've actually got them docked together pretty well right here. So we're going to go grab a car or a truck or something. We're going to load it up and we're going to take it to the next island, which hopefully if I zoom out enough, we can see. Yeah, just there. We're going to go around here and dock at that island right there. Um, because this thing isn't very fast. Anyway, um, let's get to it. Yeah. Okay, so I guess first of all, we need to lift up these things right here if we can. So let's just duck underneath. There we go. Uh, you can control this ramp right here and I believe the gate as well. Uh, from inside, which is pretty cool. Uh, but we're going to go ahead and open up this door. Uh, and hopefully we can... How do we open the barrier? I don't know how we open the barrier. There's generators here and stuff, which is interesting. Uh, and right here we've got the barrier up, barrier down. Here we go. We can do one side. Oh no, that does both. That does do both. Barrier up, barrier down, ramp down, ramp up. Alright, okay, cool. So you can control the ramp from in there as well as the barriers. Yes, cool. Right, so I'm going to go ahead and grab a truck or something and um, try and pull it on there. And hopefully it'll be all right. All right, we're going to be using this, which is the hover van from Top Gear. Um, hopefully we can actually make it over there. Uh, and if the ferry sinks, then we can just drive away because we're in a hover van. Um, I don't know how well this works, but uh, we can give it a go as well. So if we can somehow start the engine, that's the lift engine. We don't want that thrust engine. Here we go. The Ottle up. Yes. The Ottle up. Actually, we don't need this. We don't need that. All right, here we go. We're driving. Look at it. Beautiful. So obviously, this thing was the hover van from Top Gear. Um, and whoa. Whoa, 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 whoa. Throttle down with that, please. Jesus. We're going fast. Oh, we were going fast. Uh, so we've got normal driving wheels underneath. Uh, we've also got thrust for, like, engines. Uh, somewhere. And we've also got an, an engine thruster thingamabobby on the back. Yeah. Here we go. Here we go. Look at this. Look at this. That ramp's a bit steep. This ramp is, is less steep, so it should be fine. And then hopefully we can drive straight onto here. Do, 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 do. Park in the middle, and everything will be fine. Maybe. Alright, here we go. Do we have... Do we have a handbrake? Or anything? I... I mean, it doesn't appear that we do, so... Yep, it doesn't appear that we have a handbrake at all, so... There we go. It's <laughs> it's just gonna be rolling about, I guess. Sure, why not? Uh, we don't need to go back out there, because we can control everything from upstairs. Okay, so to go upstairs, we just open here, and you get to go into the main cabin thingamabobby, which is just at the top of these stairs. Um, ba 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 bam This is where, like, all the people would sit if they got out of their cars and things. They'd come up here. Uh, out the back door, I'm not actually sure what's out here. There is nothing. All right, just a little balcony kind of area. If we go ahead and close that, we can go upstairs. Do, 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 do. Actually, this is a toilet. If you wanted to use the toilet, you can go in there. Uh, I do see something else outside that I didn't notice before. Uh, so around here, we've actually got a little lifeboat kind of thing. That's really cool. Um, but to actually get up to the bridge, you go out the front and you come up the stairs. And this is the bridge right here, which, as you guys can see, I've been in here before. Okay, that that didn't go well. Let me do that again. Here we go. Uh, so yeah, we're going to go inside. We're going to go ahead and close this up. We got a heater in here if we need it too. Uh, we got first passenger. Oh, okay. Uh, so, we obviously want to go backwards. So we're going to start the engine up. And we're going to reverse. Do, 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 do. We're also going to actually lift up the docking ramp. And we're going to lift up our ramp as well. So our ramp's coming up. There we go. The docking ramp is going to go up as well. There we go. Beautiful. And we're going to start reversing out. Here we go. So the clutch goes in, in reverse. And we should start moving away, which indeed we are. Nice. Uh, and then what we've got to do is we've got to bring the gate down, which is that bit. And then we'll be back to a normal boat. Or look like a normal boat, which is cool. There we go, good. So we jump out of this seat, we run to this side, and we do this. 
and then we do this. We should be able to just drive like a like a normal a normal ship, which yeah, that looks like it's happening. Um, obviously that thing doesn't have any brakes, so it is just gonna roll around, uh, which kind of sucks a little bit. Um, but we're going. It it worked, you know. The docking ramps actually spawn like everywhere, if that makes sense. Uh, so if I press one real quick, it'll keep the throttle up or the clutch in, I should say. Hold on. Let me make sure it gets to the right one. We need to get it to one, basically. Da 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 da. All right, that'll do. That'll do right there. Um, so yeah, if we press N and we select the the ramps and we click here, we can actually see that they're on, like almost every island. Look at that. Look at that. That is crazy. But we're only going to the multiplayer island, which is just around the corner. Luckily enough for us, because it is slow. It is very slow. All right, so we are quite far away now. Uh, I've been attempting to turn this entire time. You can see your rudder position right there. Uh, and it's best to leave it not fully left, because I don't think you turn as much if you're fully left. Um, but like around this location right here, I think you turn the most. Um, anyway, I've been doing that for a while now. And uh, we are not turning. We are listing though because there's a there's a van and it's it's over to the side. Now if you have a little look inside of this thing, uh, you can see that the active stabilization is is not actually very big. Um, it's this block right here. There is also one at the front. Uh, I don't think there are any in the middle. Uh, however, there is an engine room which I believe we can actually get to. So if we keep turning and we get ourselves pointing in the right direction, we're gonna go downstairs and have a little look. But before we do that, we're going to change it to night time. And I'm going to show you guys where the lights are. So, nav lights are right here. They were already on. I just turned them off. Uh, if we turn them on now, like this, then there's our nav lights. A red one and a green one. And there must be a white one somewhere, but I don't see it. Maybe it's this up here. I don't think it is, though. Uh, we've also got spotlights, which is this one right here. Uh, which is uh, there. You can see them. Uh, that didn't appear to turn on. Oh, there we go. So we've obviously got spotlights on the front, which is pretty cool. This spotlight doesn't... Is that a spotlight? That is a spotlight. It doesn't appear to do anything, um, which is interesting. And then we've also got deck lights, which appear to already be on, which is all this in here. Interesting. Very interesting. I don't know why those spotlights aren't really working, though. That's a little bit strange. Yeah. Right, this isn't working. Uh, the fact that we are listing is is a real big pain in the butt. So we're going to go downstairs and uh, we're going to try and figure out how to... Well, actually, we're going to just try and drive the, the truck. Um, if we can. Uh, the van. Sorry, drive the van. That's what we need to do. Uh, we're just going to jump off the top. That seems like a great plan. Um, and we're going to try and move it. Uh, hopefully it can drive under its own power while it's listing and, yep, in the corner. <laughs> uh, right, okay, we're inside. We're going to press 1. And we are driving. Okay, we are, in fact, moving. We are moving. Oh, we're doing it. We're doing it. Yes. Guys, this is amazing. There we go. We're just going to park right here. Uh, the fact that we don't have any brakes sucks a little bit. Um, but there's not much we can do about that. So, yeah. Anyway, uh, we've moved it to the left now. So we should be able to turn left. That's, that's, it. well, hopefully that works. Anyway, yeah, we do appear to be, like, turning now, uh, which we, we didn't appear to be doing before. So, listing to the left, good, very good. <laughs> Hopefully we can actually line up on this thing anyway. So, the, the dock, I think, is facing, it might be facing down, but it, I think it might just be on the end of the pier. I'm not actually entirely sure, so uh, we got some working out to do uh, before we get there, because uh, at the minute, I don't see it. So, yeah, this might be difficult. Anyway, while we're turning to the left, uh, because I don't think I need to be in the seat for us to turn left when, when it's leaning left, uh, I think it'll just turn by itself. Uh, so we're just going to go downstairs and try and figure out how to get all the way downstairs. Uh, I want to see the engine room, for one, and um, it's not on this side, so it must be on the other side. Hold on, stairs down must be over here, right? Stair down, yeah, here we go. So, there's another seating area down here. There's a little cafe if you wanted to buy some things. Uh, here's the door button right down there. Where does this go? Oh, there's like a pool table. Amazing! Shoot, shoot, pew! Uh, and then we got some cabins if you wanted to go to sleep. All right, awesome. There's only a few. They're crew cabins, uh, and that's fine. All right, closed door. We don't need to go in there. Uh, unless that's how you get to the engine room. Where, oh, yeah, this is a toilet. 
So we must get to the engine room through through here somewhere. Because this seems like a staff area. But is it? I don't know. I don't know if it is. Maybe this is the engine room? No, crew cabin three. How do we get to the engine room? Let's uh, have a little have a little sneaky peeky around. So there's the engine room right there. We must get to it through... What? You get to it from the deck? Well, I wasn't expecting that. Okay, right, so. All of this can stay how it is, that's okay. We're gonna go upstairs. And just around the corner, right here, we can get to the engine room. Interesting. Very interesting. Is this lights? Yeah, this is lights. There we go. And there's the engines. We got two diesels, two big diesels. We got loads of equipment. We got some emergency power if we needed it. And we got lights. We've also got a heater as well if we need it, but we don't. So there we go. We've, we've, we found everything on the ferry, I think. Hopefully that's everything. I don't know. I hate missing things, but it happens. Uh, right, okay, we're outside. We're going to go ahead and close that up. That door's closed. We're going to get inside this one and close it. We'll keep the stair light on and, uh, yeah, we'll get back inside the bridge. Right, so it's a little bit windy, a little bit wavy, uh, and it seems to be dealing with it completely fine. Um, if there was waves bigger than this, I think it would deal with it okay as well. Um, but if it gets hit on sideways, we're gonna have a, a struggling, a struggling docking procedure. Um, I was waiting until we could see where the dock was. Now it appears that it is uh, on the end of the pier. It is actually directly on the end of the pier. Um, we are also using the other side, so this side hasn't been docked yet, as you guys can see, because it isn't broken, uh, whereas this side has, uh, because it is broken. Um, with that being said, we should be able to dock, I don't know, I don't know whether this is going to go alright. Um, anyway, what we're going to do first is we're going to raise up our gate, here we go, it's going to go way up, there we go. Look at this camera, wait, do look at this camera, watch this. Okay, bring it back down. Keep staring at that camera, it changes. So does this one. The camera changes. That's weird. That's very strange. Um, but it's cool. You know, it's cool that that happens. That's good. Um, right, okay. So, we gotta somehow turn ourselves into this. Now, the turning circle on this thing sucks. Uh, so this is gonna be difficult. Um, but we're gonna try our best to turn in there. Yeah. Um, then we gotta lower this ramp. And as well as that, we gotta try and lower that ramp. Yeah. Oh, I think we actually lower that ramp first onto our, you see, we got a little flat bit right here. I think the ramp from the dock goes on there and then our ramp goes on top of their ramp. I, I'm pretty sure that's how it works, but I'm not, yeah, I don't know. <laughs> it's something like that anyway. Um, but after we've docked, we're going to go ahead and try and drive the top gear hover van off and then we'll try and drive the hover gear top of, top, top of van? The hover gear, dude, I can't even speak anymore. The top gear hover van, uh, we'll try and drive it around in the water because that seems like a fun idea. Um, anyway, we are actually turning into this quite nicely. Uh, let's have a little look over there. So the gate is already, or, or the ramp is already down enough. Uh, we'll have to lower it down a little bit more, but I am going to raise it up a bit. Like it's working. It's totally working. That's great. That's really good. Yeah, I'm raising it up so that we can get ourselves underneath it, and uh, then we can we can sort ourselves out from there. Okay, so just because I think this process is going to be a little bit difficult anyway, uh, I've turned the wind off just to make it a little bit easier. Just a tiny bit easier. Hopefully, turning here will work. Come on, keep it turning, keep it turning. We might have to do some reversing and then going forwards, but, you know, that's fine. That is A-OK. -okay. Let's go ahead and slow ourselves down. There we go. We're going to turn off our uh, our blasty moves. There we go. Yeah, we're turning into this nicely. We're not going to make it, but we're going to be pretty close. Yeah, so there's going to be one reverse attempt, uh, and then we can go back forwards. Here we go. Keep going forwards till we pretty much hit the dock, and then we can go backwards. Oh, this is amazing. Here we go. We're just going to go backwards now, uh, and then we'll be level with it, and everything will be fine. Okay, so I think we got enough room now. I've been reversing a tiny bit, just a really tiny bit. That's fine. Uh, we're going to go left because reversing and turning right isn't working <laughs> because uh, our van is all the way over to the left. It is a little bit of a pain in the butt that we don't have anything to tie it down with. And to be fair, it's not all the ferry's fault because the van doesn't appear to have brakes. 
uh, which is also pretty strange. But that's okay. Are we going to make this turn? I think we are. We just can't turn back to the right, so we're going to go left as little as possible. <laughs> um, and then it'll be fine. I think. Maybe. We totally got this, though. Obviously, we don't want to smash into it like I did last time. Uh, but you guys didn't see that, so maybe we do want to do that. Um, but yeah, we're going to go as slowly as possible into here. And we do have to get grabbed by the thing. Otherwise, we're going to have issues. Oh, dude, look at it from here. Oh, this is cool. This is very cool. Um, yeah, I can't turn to the right because we are listing so far to the left. Yeah. Ugh, that's an issue. We're going to have to use um, that ramp right there to, like, level us out, I guess? Oh, my. Okay, right, this is fine. This is fine. Docking ramp down. Come on. Here we go. Not working. Hold on. Hold on. We're going to go backwards a tiny bit. Yes. Okay, then we're going to go forwards again. Docking ramp down. Dude, is this going to work? I need to go forwards. It is revving like crazy. Also, it is totally turning away from the dock. Which is not good. Because I can't turn back to the right. Ah! Okay, that's fine. That's fine. Down. And down. No, not gate. Not gate. Ramp. Ramp down. There we go. There we go. We're leveling ourselves out. Good. Gate up again. There we go. If we could get our van off of there, that would be perfect. Right, here we go. <laughs> so, yeah. We struggled docking. And that is what the ferry is for. So, that's a bit of a pain in the butt. But, um, if we manage to get out using that tiny little gap, that would be cool. That would be very cool. Alright, here we go. Here we go, indeedy. We're driving. We're driving our little truck. Our little van. Yep. There we go. Oh, we're driving it really quickly. All right, slow down a bit. Slow down. Here we go. Yeah, we're too big. We are too big. Oh, that sucks. That's a little bit annoying. Uh, what I might try is this. This might go well. Um, is I'm gonna try and push it. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna try and push it sideways. Uh, we can refuel the ferry. Ooh, that might be an idea too. That might be an idea. Although, probably not. I don't think pushing this is actually working. Um, there are refueling points on, I believe, both sides. So, if we jump over our van. Do, 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 do. There is a... Oh, they're both broken. They are both broken. But, if there's a thing here, we might be able to use it. Yes. Yes, very good. All right, down. Okay, come on, come on, I'm going to take you with me, and we're going to try and drag the the thing over, yeah, we should actually have some on both sides, a little winch like right there somewhere, a little winch here, and a winch on the other side so we can pull the ferry to the right place, would actually be pretty cool I think, yes, anyway, um, like a mooring line kind of thing, right, attach this under here, Oh, does it not attach when it's broken? I thought it still attached, it just didn't work. Never mind. Right, anyway, we've tried the ferry. <laughs> um, it, it was alright if there was nothing on it. If there was, yeah, if it was level, we would have probably docked fine. Uh, but because we had the Top Gear hover van on, it, it didn't. It didn't dock fine. Um, so, yeah. Right, we're going to try the van by itself. Wait, is it sinking? It looks like it's sinking. Right, we're just going to drive off with the hover van then. Hopefully, we can do this. Let's get in the little seat. There we go. Do this, and do this. Uh. Well, that didn't go well. Did it? That didn't go well at all. Lift. No, turn the lift one off. Turn this one on. I'm so confused. How does this work? I'm now a submarine, not a hover van. Okay, we need to retry this one. Right, so you start the engine by pressing 1, and that starts the normal engine where we can drive around using our wheels. Uh, we're going to go down to the beach, 
Um, and then we're going to turn on the rest of them and then hope for the best. Because it should float. Actually, we're just going to use the ramp here. We're going to drive down in it. In ew, Drive down into the water. And everything's going to be fine. Okay, please don't jump this. We're jumping it. Whee! There we go, that's fine. And we're jumping into the ocean. Hey! Please float. Is it going to float? The van itself is, is empty. Or pretty much empty. Okay, that's good. We need the lift engine thingamabobby on. Here we go. We're revving them up like crazy. Did I have to start them before we got into the water? I think I did. Maybe I did. They're not starting now. Oh, I might be doing it wrong. So apparently the hover driver is that seat and the, the land driver is, is this seat. So uh, we're just gonna, we're gonna turn this on again, turn this on again. Okay, we're gonna go into the water and then we're gonna switch seats and see what happens. Oh, it broke itself. It's breaking itself. It has broken itself. I, am I stuck in the, in the thing? I might be stuck in the in the ground. Yeah, look, my wheel is like, my wheel is through the floor. Right, one more time. <laughs> one more time. Uh, I am really struggling with this. Uh, so we're just gonna turn them on, and then we're gonna drive into the water, and then we're gonna switch to the other seat, and hopefully that'll be fine. Maybe. All right, here we go. Oh, those things drop down. That's interesting. Uh, right, so we're going to get a little bit in the water. Like so. And then we're going to turn on this. And this. We're going to switch seats. Okay, that didn't work. Come on. How do I use this thing? My throttles are full. Okay, whatever. That's fine. Do this. Do this. Change seat. Is it working? No. I, I, uh, I try my best. I try my best, but it's not moving. It broke. I broke boat. I mean... Yeah, hover van. Um, right, anyway, um, the main video was, was, was okay. Um, the van, I don't know how you work it, so, um, I'm gonna let you guys deal with that. Um, and, yeah, yeah. Anyway, uh, I'll link you everything, uh, and you guys can play with all of them for yourselves, and hopefully, maybe one of you guys can get this thing moving in the water. Um, yeah. Anyway, uh, thank you guys for watching, hope you guys enjoyed it, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Goodbye.